skip college. When my son left for school, I was so proud. But like a lot of other parents, I was worried too. Worried that when he finished, he would find work, pay for his own home and food, maybe even start a family of his own. But thanks to college, I don't have to worry about that anymore. Because like so many graduates, my son is unemployed and crippled by debt. It's forced him to move back into my home and into my heart. My son might not have any marketable skills and he might not be able to support himself financially, but his time spent in college has made him a better person. He knows a couple of Shakespearean sonnets and a lot about the Boer War. And he wrote his thesis on binary economic theory. And that makes him better than other people's children who didn't go to college. And isn't that the most important thing? <gasps> oh my goodness, big boy. You feel better? Yes, you are. You're the best boy. I got debt. <gasps> yes, you do. Yes, you do. You got the biggest debt. Sometimes I drive him around to help him fall asleep. He gets cranky without a nap. The quality time that we're spending is worth so much more to me than the thousands and thousands of dollars that we owe in student loans for college. Yes, there oh, you go. Oh, he's adorable. Oh, thank you. Oh, how old are you? 260 months. <laughs> oh, so cute. Did he just graduate college? Yes, he did. Oh. Oh, did he make the dean's list? Absolutely. Oh. Yes, he was oh, magna cum laude. Oh, and what was, was your major? What was your major? Oh, he majored in economics with a minor in communications. Oh, so smart. You're so smart. Yes, you are. I bet you're going to grad school. Oh, definitely. Oh, Come so on, cute. honey. Are you hungry? Oh, so you're hungry, aren't you? Oh, Come on, let's go hungry. get some foodies. Oh. We know this dream can't last forever. But he has been talking about graduate school. And once he gets that master's degree, we'll be right here, ready to support him and his increasingly insurmountable debt load once again. I can hardly wait. So please, don't sacrifice your child's education because of cost or practical value. We owe everything we have to college, literally, more than our mortgage. And it's definitely worth it.